Hey, what's up, everybody? Anthony Conklin, anthonyjconklin.com. Keynote speaker, sales leader, a lot of energy to share with you, connecting your passion, your purpose, finding your why. 26 years in corporate America, 27 years in the entertainment space. I hope you guys are having a great day today. Talking to you live from Portland, Oregon. Yeah. First time in, Plur Port yeah. <laughs> First time in Portland, Oregon. Uh, going on meetings with one of the sales managers that works for me in the region. We are uh, visiting, uh, we had a couple meetings today, been on the go since early this morning. Uh, we have another six or nine meetings set up for tomorrow. We'll be traveling also to Salt Lake City and uh, meeting with folks in Salt Lake, Salt Lake City, Utah. And then we'll be in Lehigh, Utah. And then we're gonna be flying back to California for have a couple meetings there. So hope you guys are having a great day today. How important is it let me ask you this question. How important is it to have in-person meetings, like shaking someone's hand or giving someone a hug or s smelling the lunch or the coffee or the food or just the environment, just the, the smell of a restaurant, the feel, the ambience, right? You cannot get that feeling over the phone. You can't get that feeling when you live stream. You can't get that feeling when you Skype. You can't get that feeling when you be live. Now, don't get me wrong. Now, hold on a minute. Before you throw me under the bus, I love to live stream. I love video. I think it's so, so important. Hey, Frank, thanks for joining. Thank you so much. Delilah's in the house. Thank you so much. So I want to say that it's so important meeting people in person. You know, I have found that in my business, I like to talk over Skype or over whether it be live TV or whether it be Facebook Live or Instagram. But I'm telling you right now, the power of meeting people in person completely supersedes anything digital. Now, sending pictures back and forth and video and sending selfies and, and quick messages is really great, but you cannot ever underestimate the power of meeting someone in person because I'm telling you, meeting people in person is so much more exciting. And I have to tell you, it's my, my dirty, not my dirty, it's my clothes back there. So meeting people in person is so much more powerful because what you do is you get a sense of what they're feeling, what they're thinking, and you build that bond. Building bonds with people in person is so much more powerful. I mean, there are people I've done business with, there are people I've done business with that I met digitally, and then when I met them in person, it just completely solidified that relationship. I mean, there are people I know from the live streaming world that uh, I've known for years. There are people I know in live streaming for the past three years who I've not met in person, who I've built great relationships with. However, however, if you wanna build true, deep, impactful, intimate connections with people, you need to get your ass on a car, in a car, plane, train, automobile, walk, and meet them in person, shake their hand, give them a hug, look them in the eye, experience their physical space, because that is where true relationships are solidified, is when you meet them in person. Now, I'm not saying you have to go and meet everybody because it's impossible to do that. In this world, in this digitally connected world, it's impossible to go meet everybody all at once. But I would tell you this. Here are some tips on how to build deep, impactful relationships with people that you meet online or people that you've met digitally. First of all, is let your intentions be known. Say, hey, listen, why don't we meet at this networking event? You know, people go to social media marketing world, or people go to you know Tony Robbins event. I had the great pleasure of meeting some great people at Tony Robbins event, where I didn't, I never met them before in person. When I met them at Tony Robbins event, fantastic relationship. So one, let your intentions be known. Number two, don't make it creepy, right? So guys, if you're going to meet females, and if you're married or they're married, don't make it creepy. Don't make it like. Anything other than, listen, we're meeting for you know, professional reasons, we're getting connected, we're both building relationships, you know, professional and building personal relationships. Don't make it creepy. And, and girls, uh, women, don't make it creepy either, right? Let your intentions be known that you're either married or you're involved in somebody, you're not meeting for a hookup. You're meeting sincerely to build a relationship, to build a deep, intimate connection. So let your intentions be known, don't make it creepy. And number three is just do it. Just do it. Schedule the time, get in the car, have you get in the car, have them get in the car, go set a time and just do it, right? And it's not gonna be perfect. There are gonna be times where you're gonna meet people and it's just not gonna work out because your schedule changes. You know, I know for me, I've had to change my schedule two or three times to meet with people. I'm supposed to meet somebody Wednesday in California, I can't do it because I gotta go fly to Salt Lake City. That doesn't mean I don't like the person, it's just, it's just not gonna work that way. So I would say let your intentions be known, 
right? So the three tips on how to build deep personal relationships with people you meet online. One, let your intentions be known. Tell them, hey, we should meet in person. Let's build that relationship. That's number one. Number two, don't make it creepy, okay? Go meet in a public place. Go meet in a public restaurant. Go meet in a Starbucks. Go meet in a place where everybody's visible and accessible. And number three, just do it. Just do it. Get in the car, get on your bike, get on a train, go meet them in person, and believe me, it's it's gonna make such a big difference. Those relationships when you meet them in person, you're either gonna know right away that it's gonna work, or you're gonna strike up a great relationship, a great connection, and you'll build off of that. So, hope that was helpful for you guys. Once again, Anthony Conklin, I'm anthonyjconklin.com. Also right here on Facebook, I'm also on Instagram at Anthony dot ace find me there 26 years in corporate america 27 years in entertainment space sales leader keynote speaker love to come speak at your event please call me leave a note share this out if you like it please share it out if you like it i appreciate it i'm grateful for you and in the words of les brown you have greatness within you you have a very special gift and it's your job every year every day to live that gift and share it with the entire planet until next time i love you guys and i'll see you soon